Hello, everybody. James Widener here with head coach Dave Trumbull after Stevenson runs their record to 17-4 and with a big 3-1 win over their Maryland rival, St. Mary's College of Maryland. Dave, um, everybody got to play tonight. Um, do your thoughts on tonight's match. Uh, we came out really strong. We did not have our best match of the year against Widener, uh, and we were a little off. It was good for us to come out, didn't miss a serve, didn't miss, did, had no hitting errors, and uh, played. In fact, we sided out eight out of nine times. So I was real pleased the way we came out tonight. Well, great. Um, a couple of things tonight. It's obviously was senior night. You honored your three seniors. One thing I want to talk about is Olivia Simon, who um, hadn't played all year because of an ACL, and you got her in the game. What's What does it mean to get her some action today in, in, on senior night? Well, his, her uh, doctor cleared her okay. just, <laughs> just to stay on the court, and it was okay with our trainers. Uh, and that's all she could do. She really isn't cleared to play. She's working, trying to get back to beach. Uh, Olivia ha is uh, just such a wonderful teammate and will do anything to help us. And she didn't expect to serve more than once. And you know, she even, you know, she said, I don't, I, I don't have to serve. Right. But, you know, because she's always thinking about somebody else. And uh, it was, she had a really good night. And, I mean, she... This is her second year she hasn't played. She doesn't right. have to come out here. Right. She's probably – the chances are she'll never play indoor volleyball again. But she is such a good teammate, and she wants to be around the girls and help them out. So I'm glad everything turned out well for her tonight. And on senior night, it, it's, uh, you know, it's poetic that uh, Riley Kimball and Darian Dildy both had 12 kills to lead the, uh, lead the Mustangs on senior night. Well, I tried to keep them in. Yeah, you know, I, I try. I tried to keep the seniors in right. uh, in the game, and Darian and Riley are having a really good season. And uh, we've got to keep the momentum rolling into Saturday against Marymount. It's going to be a really tough match. That's what I was about to ask you. Know, you're coming off. You come off. You said with Widener, you win tonight against St. Mary's. You know, you have that Eastern match looming next week. But Marymount, very, very good team, very, very tough team. You're going down there. Um, how do you keep the, the the girls focused? You know, not. Not that they're going to over, overlook Marymount, but, you know, it's you have that Eastern match. How do you keep them focused for Marymount? Well, we do talk a lot about regional rankings. Yes. And Marymount, I don't know, you look at their record, but they have played an incredibly difficult schedule. So, And they're beating good teams. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's Dig Pink. I think mm -hmm. it's, it's homecoming. It's everything, you know, so the place is going to be packed. We got a little dose against Widener playing in somebody else's gym, and they were fired up to play us. So I know Marymount will be fired up, and that's gonna that's a key game. It, it's one that we need to take. Well, good luck on Saturday. Thanks. That was the uh, head coach Dave Trumbo after the three-one win over St. Mary's tonight. Again, Mustangs back in action on Saturday as they take on Marymount. Don't forget next Wednesday the home match with Eastern seven o'clock. Looking to set an attendance record, come on out to Owings Mills Gym for a great MAC Commonwealth matchup. Thanks for watching. Get all the action here on GoMustangSports.com. Thanks for watching and go Stangs.